15 <laughs> is... You know what? You have Enchantress and Hoodling, which are great for you to win the lane. So you can be lane. Sniper is even worse. Okay. It's just annoying. That's all right. You know, it's like... Oh, here we go. This might be oh, a dream. Mel Reed's already caught out. <laughs> Beautiful shots from Tian Ming. Mel Reed, he is gone. Are you happy, John? I am satisfied. I'm a happy little camper. No You're welcome. in this game, please. Ops are terrible weapons. But sadly, they're already off to Yeah. They're still hanging around in oh, this area. Tian oh, Tian God. He's got another one. I mean, this guy's just fishing at the moment. Crit does at least get a nice bushwhack, but it won't matter. Crit is down, except to take the kill this time around. And you and I know from casting back in the day when Chun Ming was. Although, again, it's not stopping that farm. Good news for Azure is they've got to build up up top in Skipper. Yeah, Skid has been left behind again. Time Walk is going to be out, but that was the only Time Walk he had. XXS happy to dive in past the T1 tower for now. CQ still chasing as well. XXS, he's taking a fair bit of damage here. Skidder still not down. We'll look to turn back around onto CQ now as Crit does rotate and CQ is dead. Very nice rotation from Crit, realizing they have gone way too far in hell. Even Snaking now moving in. XXS not out of the woods, so they do not have the enchant to perch him up. Skidder going to try with the time dilation, and now the bushwhack. Even the T1 tower is being tanked here by the Alpha Wolf, and XXS really regretting his oh. decision to dive that deep. He will be punished heavily by this. Walking people. So. The counterplay with that oh, tier one dive just isn't quite there. Nice bushwhack, Sing Q, not expecting the rotation, and Crit will be able to snipe the Wisdom Rune. Well worth his life. You take that every single time, no doubt about that. Nice freebie to they take. Just keep Chan Ming here. He has four, he has the value point in Snowball. Skidder, big surround, in comes Chan Ming. Skidder, he has Time Walk, but he's going to be very careful how he uses it. Snowball will lock him down anyway, and Skidder, he just never gets a chance. Great kill now for Azura Ray, and that's what they really want. Problem is XM. Gonna get ganked up mid lane now. The pincer maneuver out from Falcons, and XM is just gonna absolutely melt to the damage. Snake into secure that killer. Sting Q actually gonna try for a trade onto Maureen. Gets the Beatles off. Here comes Tian Ming. Maureen, though, still surviving, being healed up by Snake, and can they get the that's damage so out? Heal. It doesn't seem like it. Oh, hands up from Maureen. Waves him goodbye, and Snaking, he takes a double. Ready to go in when this minus armor strat kicks in, and they can take a fight and melt objectives. We're nowhere near close to that yet. Tian Ming, get onto Maureen. Do they actually have the damage for this? Maureen, he might just stand his ground. Shards are out, he'll get locked down. Sting Q from the backside going onto the sniper. Hands up, Tian Ming, maybe a little bit early, is still gonna find the sniper, but he will drop. A two for one trade, but it'll make it a two for two. It's a pretty damn even at the end. You could make the argument, Maureen, he got You're quite still a bit position down bot going through the gate again. I want to try and go up to Skidder. Instead, ATF top lane being caught by Tian Ming. They do inhibit as well with the Spirit Bear, though ATF forced to throw the boat out. We'll try and go after the Spirit Bear, but it does get just respawned here from me. Here. No mess. Here we go again. Maureen, the big target. But with the tag team, you might actually just be able to deal with him with these two heroes. In fact, they do jump in. Spirit Vessel out. Maureen's got help on the way, but he's dropping really low. Skidder moving in. Maureen, he is still alive. And oh it seems though God. AR, they do not have the damage to get the job done. Sing Q now being targeted, and Sing Q is going to go down to boot. Wishful thinking from he the side of A. Already has the Maelstrom and Mask of Madness. Going into BKB, they spot Snake King. But... Yeah, Snake King. It's a classic snaking play, just set up for the team. Here comes ATF. ATF there to back him up. Tian Ming, not happy with what he's seeing, because he's been caught out. Shallow Grave is going to keep him alive for now, as ATF is being targeted by the side of Azura Ray. Still Tian Ming alive again, as the smoke will avoid the assassinate. ATF in the meantime, dropping low, but is still able to walk low? away just barely as low. Does get caught by the Chrono. He is gone. That's a massive one for the side of Falcons as they continue to try and chase down Maureen. Though he has been healed up now, he's perfectly fine. Azur Ray still getting both supports, but they want some cores. They'll try for ATF again. Onto Maureen they go, but Maureen's fine. ATF's still alive. Sting Q's still trying. Sting Q does go for the time lapse and secures the ATF kill. Sting Q eventually will die for that, but it's well worth his time and life. That's a massive back and forth. The timeliness of the Axe flying in for XM ensures that... X is going to be there. They've got the Tusk, but the Snowball is going to allow him to get away from that. Back towards the Creep Wave, Tian Ming. 
has ruined the surprise initiation. Maureen, he is very far forward. Is this really a bait from Maureen? It may just be, because he's still alive. The Spirit Bear, the thing that's dropping really low, and it is gone. However, Maureen still dropping lower, but somehow still alive. Low, still sending in more. There, there goes go. Maureen and the Sniper. He's finally down. Meanwhile, Tian Ming being focused here by the Void, but Skidder trying to go back after low. Decides better off it. Goes after XXS. There's your Chrono. He wants in Q, but the XM Dazzle, it's right outside the Chrono. He is not going to be able to kill anyone. And AT He's going for a TB, but he's, he's, in, he's within vision. He is within vision. That's you do have that secondary life available on the lone druid, so more than happy to try and put him back. Ooh. Hold on a minute. Tian Ming, he finds ATF. The Harpoon going to drag him back as well. With the shards out, ATF doesn't have many places to go, but a great tidal wave. If the Torrent Storm still going, Tian Ming is down and low is going to drop as well. Or at least the bear will. His first life still intact, but not looking too good as the Bushwhack going to drag him right back into the loving arms of Falcons. And now the Chrono, it's only got the bear. Skidder, what's the plan with this? Sir? He gets the Spirit Bear, I suppose. It was just resummoned, so that's a lot of time where Lo is actually not going to be able to do anything. Yeah, he's he has nothing. So it's basically going to be 4v5. Falcons, they fight into... A really good position. And jumping on Falcons Martin. ultimately still not going to be able to really capitalize because Roshan is still 20 seconds away. It's close enough time that they're still going to be comfy trying to hunt here. XMTP's out. Looks like they'll miss out on Tianming as well. Instead, XXS now is the target. It's still a great target to go after. Though he's a bit of a tanky boy, but XXS slowly dropping. Eventually will go down. He's down for 70 without buyback. More pings coming up. They want Sin Q. Crits on the chase, a nice bushwhack, gonna land onto the Weaver. Sinkyu still trying to run. Skidder on the chase now to boot. Time lapse away from Sinkyu. ATF looking for an X back, still not able to find it, but a nice tidal wave. Gonna drag him back, and Sinkyu still trying to run, but eventually seems like he would. Oh, the bushwhack! Not gonna land, but it won't matter. They do find the Weaver. There's a lot of pickoffs to set up here for the side of Falcons. They are rushing forward, they have some forward vision here as well with Ward. CQ back up in three seconds to boot. Low, he's going to find Snake King. Roshan, about a quarter HP left. Dazzle Shadow Poison out. Crit, unable to land a Bushwhack this time around as Skidder is very far forward. He does still have his BKB to commit, and the Chrono don't forget. XXS trying to create all sorts of havoc here with the Primal Split, but it's a very prolonged team fight. Tian Ming trying to run. Bushwhack will not land. Skidder, he'll cop the Beatles now. Me. Oh, Maureen! Oh. Maureen is down. Snake King also being chased here by Azul Ray. Skidder, he's going to pop the Chrono. He's found a couple targets, but XM, he's outside of the Chrono with the, sh with, with, with the save as Skidder. He just cannot finish the job off. The Shallow Grave more than enough as Skidder is oh down. My God. And with that, I mean, they might find Tian Ming, but they're losing ATF. ATF to boot is down, and that's four for really the price of one. Not great news if you're Falcons. Yeah, it's, it's actually, it's it's not fully a meme. Top lane, ATF. Bought here by XXS and Sin Q. We'll try. Create all sorts of havoc here with the Torrent Storm. As Sin Q now actually caught out, does go down. ATF is still alive, still backing off. XXS desperately trying to finish the job. But ATF will make it. In fact, XXS. They've got the option for Tian Ming. Jump is there, crit, they know, Tian Ming, blink away, but surely, surely he is caught, and he will be. No way out of this one, the Tusk is down, but buyback is available. Roshan now officially up. They've got to get back towards the base, this is not looking good right now for Falcons. It is just such an expensive Roshan attempt, the kickback is there. Snaking. He's the man to jump in. He's a tanky boy. He'll survive for now. They're trying to find a target, but look at Low and XXS. They're just taking all the Raxes. Sin Q, he's being targeted, but who the hell cares? He, he's a Weaver. He's a support Weaver. Who cares? I don't, no one cares. They lose two set of Racks. Maybe yeah. you just go for tier 4 towers at this stage. It, it's a difficult prospect to offer that. Like, you don't have ATF. You don't have that boat or Torrent Storm. You can Siege, but... It doesn't feel safe to take this team fight, especially since you popped your refresh chrono onto a support here. And I really don't know if you can afford to lose Skidder. Like he just he sacrificed so much for that Aegis, oh, and the gone. Aegis is just gone. 
Oh boy, here we go. This is the last ditch attempt for Falcons, I think. Skitter, it's gonna be a great chrono. They're trying to go after Sting Q. It looks like they might have him. Problem is ATF dropping just as low Sting Q. He'll take him with him. The Conker goes down for the Weaver. And meanwhile, the Radiant Base. There will be a single chrono ready in a few seconds. So there is at least that for Falcons. Oh, Skitter caught with the Warriors. No, he's okay. XXS, just going right after the Tier 4 tower. So will Low and the Tier 4's gone. This is dirty. This is a oh, very oh. dirty way to win the game, but Low, he's going for it. The Ancient under siege. Primal split out. Skinner, he's going to have to chrono these units to try and get rid of him, I think. He's still trying to fight this one out. XXS is still just focusing on the Ancient. Somebody deal with this guy. Low, he brings the bear no, back in. It's all it's over. Done. It is all <laughs> over. Score <laughs> a raid.